So you need to build some shelves for your shed. Step one, get a giant piece of plywood. Step two, cut it in half. Next with our circular saw and speed square, we're gonna be cutting to length our front and back rails. Next, we're gonna cut all of our stretchers. These are the pieces that connect the front and back rails. Now these are gonna be 21 inches long as our shelf is 24 inches deep. That's just 24 minus the three inches for the front and back two by four. With everything cut to length, we can go ahead and mark off both of our back pieces right here because we're making two shelves, all the locations for our braces. So we got two in the middle here and then one at the eight foot mark because our plywood comes in eight foot lengths as well as the ones on the very end. Then we'll transfer those markings to the front rails as well, except there's gonna be a three and a half inch offset on both sides as it is going to tuck into the stud cavity where we're gonna install some braces for some extra support along the front. To assemble this, we're just gonna use three inch screws, two at each joint. So here we are inside the shed and you see I've got some blocking and bracing we need to install. We're gonna put two temporary blocks along the back that's gonna support the back of the shelf when we go to put it in place. I've already got marked out my height, 44 inches off the ground, whatever height you'd like, do yourself. But over here on the side, this is this brace where we made that front rail extra long to go inside here. Because the front of the shelf isn't gonna rest exactly on a stud, that's the reason we're doing this. So it'll rest directly on that brace and it'll be totally supported, super strong. So with the shelf in place, I'm just gonna attach it to all the two by four studs where I can with three inch screws. So now I'll install the other two braces and I'll move those temporary blockings up to the next height and we'll get the next shelf up here. And there's our shelves. The last thing to do is just throw down the plywood on top, screw it down and we're ready for some storage. We'll just cut a little scrap piece to fit in there and good as gold. And there you have it. Two of our shed shelves are made. Time to load them up with a bunch of crap. Too easy.